The upcoming release of the new Campaign Battle of France supplement for Bolt Action offers 128 pages of scenarios and more for gaming World War II in France and Belgium during the summer of 1940. This is a softback book providing special rules, amendments and suitable army lists for gamers. The book begins with something of a disclaimer, quite rightly pointing out that this isn't a history book. It then presents 12 fully detailed scenarios, each one complete with a really useful overview of the historical events before and after each one. These can be played as one-offs or linked together to create a mini campaign. The type of scenarios range from small-scale recon platoon contacts up to full-on battles, counter-attacks, protecting the ever-collapsing perimeter, the final evacuation from the Dunkirk beaches. There are also less obvious fare, such as an attack on part of the Maginot Line and the ill-fated invasion of France by Italian forces. The new unit section contains something for all the protagonists, from extra options for the Belgium Chasseurs Aldenais, to British Pioneer Corps and Intelligence Services, Royal Engineers, French Naval Units, French Cadet Sections, 5th Columnist Units who aid the German invasion, and the feared and hated Feld Gendarmerie, or German Military Police. There are also new rules and national characteristics for different intelligence units and even war correspondents. The theatre selectors cover a generic anti-tank gun reinforcement platoon to specialist units such as the BEF motorcycle platoon, the Grenadier Guards, the makeup of the French Chasseurs Alpins reinforcement platoon, scenario specific forces and previously less known forces such as the Italian reinforcement platoon. A number of special and new rules are included in this supplement, as well as rules for digging in, and many types of minefields are also covered, as are amphibious assaults. There is also a whole new section of rules called air battles, allowing for the integration of fighter and bomber combat into the game. These include the role of ground attack and air defence. Another set of unique rules is entitled Company Commander, which expands the basic bolt action platoon level combat to the next level, that of the larger company with more than one platoon. In a very real sense, these could be said to be a major expansion of the infantry combat rules, as are the rules for aircraft. These seem to be refined and expanded versions of previously existing rules, possibly based upon the author's beliefs and ideas, as are the rules for campaigns found herein. This is an obvious choice for bolt action gamers interested in gaming this particular part of the early war in France and Belgium. The inclusion of new units, army and theatre selectors, the special rules and army lists are all useful for a general BA gamer. The historical content is here and it's interesting to see how the history has been adapted to fit the rule system in terms of the scenarios. This video has been produced by WI Prime. WI Prime is Wargames Illustrated Magazine's online members club. As a WI Prime member, you get access to all Wargames Illustrated videos before anyone else. We'll keep you posted on what's new via the Primetime News Bulletin delivered to your inbox every Friday. If you are not a WI Prime member, you're missing out on loads of benefits, including access to the Wargames Illustrated Vault, freebies, discount vouchers, PDFs of the latest magazine, and more. Find out more about WI Prime by following the link.